Korere, Bukose, and the member for Chuka. Minister. Thank you. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. The list, the list I provided, Honorable Speaker, is for the number of those who attended and those who are interviewed and those who qualify. That is the consolidated list. The, 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 what I don't have and I want to follow up with, because that's the information that I have now, I have the information of those who are interviewed and qualified. I provided information of those two that were disqualified. But what I need to provide as a follow-up is information of those who are pride and the distribution. That is what I'm saying I'm going to follow up with. The information that is available here the information that is available here is only for those who are uh, those who are interviewed and those who qualify. What I'm going to do is to follow up with information of those who actually applied. Then and then we will see the whole picture. Then it is not everyone who applied that qualified. One of the things that we need to remember is that not everyone who got the information so it's in a sense we need to see the whole information and see what that third i actually provided information why the military training and that just and that justification because of the quality and the nature of the work it requires physical fitness third uh, finally i'm going to look at the census data and try to educate the census data, including the age cohort, because the census data is one component, but the age cohort is another component. So I'm going to follow up with this more comprehensive information that we can get information from. DK, give the floor to DK. All your horses. I'll hold your horses. Okay. The speaker uh, knows what to do. Thank you, for, uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker, sir. What I want to say on the issue of uh, the revenue officers, I think we cannot punish the minister, and we don't know all the data, all the data that came out, because Kenyans need to apply. <laughs> Listen. I am entitled order. to my opinion. Order, honorable members. I am entitled to my opinion. So what I'm saying, can you find out DK, how many people order, applied DK. in your area order. before castigating order. the speaker? Thank you. Order, honorable DK. Sit down. Take your seat. Honorable DK, this is question time. And the minister has not requested any support in his ability to answer questions. So I gave you an opportunity, believing you had a question to ask. The member that is uh, where ask a question. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. The Minister is not very clear in answers as far as KRA issues are concerned. The advertisement was very clear. They were recruiting clerks, even during interviews, but the military came later. But the question is, are you aware that quite a number of Kenyans were knocked out in Eldoret and they were subjected to pregnancy test and also HIV test. Are you telling me those who are in, working in, in KRA, if you are pregnant and you are HIV positive, you are not supposed to work in KRA? 
how many did you turn back after successful interview in Nairobi? Makali Mulu. Thank you very much, Honorable Speaker. Honorable Speaker, this matter of recruitment in this country is not a new matter. And I think, Honorable Speaker, this is not specific to CS Treasury. This 